seed promotion can cause unnecessary errors in Calibre LBS, interference from layers at different hierarchical levels, and sometimes uh, from property calculations, uh, such as those used in parasitic extraction flows, can force Calibre to recognize a device at a higher level than the seed chip was originally drawn. This schematic shows the original intent for the hierarchical placement of three transistors. All three devices are drawn within a cell called nested MN. That cell is placed within top cell. Now, here's a schematic showing hierarchical differences by C promotion. The nested MN cell contains only two devices now. The third device has been moved in a hierarchical sense from the lower level cell and is now accounted for in the top cell. I'll be showing some of the uh, clues that indicate seed promotion has happened in your run, and I'll share a popular method for recovering from seed promotion. This is what seed promotion can look like in the uh, transcript file or log. This is what it can look like in the extracted uh, netlist from layout. You'll see the store.c prompt statement inside of a uh, subcircuit definition. And this is what it might look like in an LBS report. There are a few different areas that might tip you off seed promotion is happening. Different numbers of instances is common during seed promotion. When you have seed promotion uh, from, uh, from a cell, devices would leave that cell, that lower level cell, in this case, clock buff one, and would appear instead at a higher level, in this case, top. If we look at the lower level cell, we would typically see a lower number of devices in the layout than the source. This happens because a device has been promoted up and out of that lower level cell. You might see a missing instance warning. On the other hand, at the higher level, we would expect to see a higher number of uh, devices in the layout. In this case, uh, clock buff one is placed five times, so when one device is promoted up and out of that cell, we'll see five extra devices at the higher level. So that's what it looks like when seed promotion is happening. Next, I'll show how to avoid seed promotion in the first place. I'll go back to the layout, I'll bring up the Calibre Interactive GUI, and I'll choose some options so that I can include an SVRF uh, rule file statement. Now the point of this command is to push devices back down into a cell when they were promoted uh, due to certain issues with the property calculation or properties that weren't needed for LBS. The command is blurred here because this is a public video on YouTube, but if you search in the SVRF manual for separate properties, you'll see the exact syntax. Once I rerun the job with that additional command, I'm able to get correct LBS. This is Chris Balcom with Global Support and Services at Mentor Graphics, a Siemens company. Thanks for watching.